a reason we need to clean our aquaponics pumps. They get covered in crap and um, they can, the water quality can start to be affected, especially the water flow. But the thing about your pumps is you need to know how they're put together and every pump is different. Oh, and when you have sore fingers, it's really hard to pull them apart. And embarrassing when you can't get it happening. There we go. So this pump, I've got to actually pull it apart so I can get to the propeller. The propeller is inside the pump and that's what will help clean up for the, ah, there we go. Um, for the water flow. So you can see, I don't want any of that in my grow bed or in my fish tank. So this pump, I'm pulling it all the way apart, which I have my bucket of water and I have my toothbrush that I don't use for my teeth. But this here is what we're needing to get to. You see how this is covered in crap? Okay, that should be all nice and clean. That will start to slow down. That's a magnet. And that will start to slow down the water flow because it's been covered with waste and it's not letting you have the pump moving properly. So I need to go through and clean all of these parts to make sure that it's all nice and clean. This is something that you should be doing at least monthly. And if you do it as a prevention, it doesn't get quite this bad.